What's up my dreamers? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm testing out three different hair straighteners, the GHD, the T3, and the Bioionic Straightener. So these are all ceramic. I didn't get titanium because I did a lot of research on that and I found out that titanium actually damages your hair long term. So the Bioionic and the GHD are both the same exact price, but the T3 is a bit more expensive. So if you aren't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoy this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and let's go ahead and get started with this dual. I just plugged in the GHD. I'm not going to turn it on until they're all plugged in. I hope this isn't a hazard to plug them all in at the same time. Like, I ain't trying to die, but you know, we need to know which one is the best. So my prediction is that I'm going to like the Bioionic the most. The one that looks the nicest, honestly, is the T3 because it's like all white and luxurious. Oh yeah, and the T3 comes with these clips for your hair. So I really like that. Like, I don't understand why straighteners don't come with clips and like a brush because I always scramble to find a brush. For instance, right now I can't find my comb and I'm gonna have to settle for my really big wide tooth comb. I actually need to go grab okay, it. So <laughs> this is the comb I'm gonna be using. Don't come for me. Honestly, whichever gets my hair straightened the best is gonna be like magical because I usually like to go in with a really tiny comb with like smaller bristles. So it has been a whole year and a lot of change since I have straightened my hair. I haven't cut it since my diva cut and we are gonna see how much longer it got. I gotta back up a little so maybe I'll just do that in the end. We'll do a length check. I really think it touches my butt now. This is the GHD, this is the Bioionic, and this is the T3. So fancy. It's just like flashing. I don't know what to do. Wow. The Bioionic is already heated up. <laughs> that was really fast. So basically, I have the T3 on 390, the Bioionic on 395. And then the GHD, the only one setting, which is 365. Now the Bioionic is ready to be used. It is all the way heated up. Um, the GHD is nowhere near heat. Oh, I literally just turned on the T3 and it's already heated up. That already tells you something. Okay, so I'm just gonna split my hair up. Okay. I always look crazy when I straighten my hair. <laughs> Let's start with the Bioionic. Okay, I'm really missing my little comb. This one's not gonna do the job. Damn, it's such a long way down. I don't think I've ever grown my hair out this long. Oh my God, it's literally like below my belly button. Wow. So here's the first part of my hair. So my initial reaction from the Bioionic is that my hair doesn't feel stiff at all. It feels like very healthy. Um, I'll say it's not like pin pin straight and it's not like shiny straight, but I feel like that's because my ends are really damaged. I mean, I haven't cut my hair in over a year. And now I'm gonna use the GHD. All right, here's the GHD with the gold. it's not even on so the t3 i don't like that i <gasps> oh 
Okay, there's a, I don't know what's happening, but let me just read what that means because that's really scary. Okay, y'all, it wasn't anything to worry about. I just read in the instructions that the red indicator light, which says LED, will begin to flash, indicating that the styler is heating up. So, I was freaking out for nothing. Um, when the styler reaches the required temperature, it emits a beep, indicating that the... It emits a beep? So that beep means it already heated up? Wow, every single one of these straighteners heat up very, very fast, so... I can't even pick a winner for that. So let's continue. Okay, so automatically I noticed, well, first thing I noticed is my hair has a lot of smoking going on. Um, I don't know if you can see. Oh, you can definitely see. So the plates aren't touching each other completely. And even when I apply a lot of pressure, there's still a little gap in between. So my hair is slipping out through those little cracks. Okay, now I just put even more pressure on my hair and my hair isn't slipping out as much as it did before. But I don't like that I have to put a lot of pressure on. So that's a red flag for Mr. GHD. Yeah, I'm also noticing that I have to go over the section multiple times to get rid of the curl in my hair. Um, I'm not liking this one at all. Like, my ends look very sad. And I'm afraid that the more I straighten it, the more my hair might fall off. <laughs> But I'm going to continue this chunk of my hair so we can compare it to the last chunk. Okay, him it, it's time for bed. I put you on airplane mode so you won't distract me. Okay, so let me bring back the chunk I did with the Bioionic. Wow. You know what? The GHD kind of looks and feels better. Let me just go over the bioionic one one more time. You know what it is? When my hair is warm, it feels much softer and looks more like silky, but as it dries up, it looks more dead and more not silky. <laughs> What do you guys think? Do you see a difference? Like, damn, my ends gotta go. All right, Mr. T3, you're up. Let's see if price really makes a straightener better. Cause this T3 is quite expensive, my friends. Wow, it's making the lights flicker as I'm using it. <laughs> Ooh. Wow, the T3 was actually much easier to use. I felt like I didn't have to go over the sections multiple times and it feels quite silky and quite smooth. Wow, what my bottle? All right, now I'm gonna do one straightener on this side and one straightener on this side. And then whichever one I like better, I'm going to cancel out the one I don't like and then battle the last two and whichever I like the best wins. And I will do the rest of this main with. There's that piece by Mr. GHD in one single pass. You can see there's still some frizz, especially when I pull the pieces apart, there's a lot of frizz. Um, yeah, so let's move on to this side. And on this side, we will be trying the Bioionic. Ooh. 
Wow, what a cute name is that? Um, let's see. There's definitely less frizz when I pick up the pieces. You can see there's a lot of frizz with the GHP. With the Bioionic, the pieces kind of just fall apart like it was my natural straight hair or something. And in terms of how they both feel, the Bioionic side definitely feels more smooth, more silky. This side feels a little rough. So Bioionic on this side, and then on this side, I will be doing the T3. We just finished the T3 section. This T3 is definitely not frizzy like the GHD. By the way, GHD, you are canceled, turned off, unplugged. T3 looks very luxurious. I just did it in one single pass. And now I'm just gonna do the bioionic side and see which one wins. Okay, so definitely the left side feels much more silky, much more sleek straight, and the right side, I don't know what's going on. The T3 is the winner. What do you guys think? Check out my new glasses. Um, I don't have them on right now to see if you can see this, but they are engraved with your girl's name. <laughs> They're a dream. Wow. That T3 feels amazing. So I'm convinced that the T3 is the best one out of all three of these. So Bioionic, you're canceled. Now I'm just going to finish off my hair with the T3. And it is on the fourth heat setting, which is about 390 degrees. Wow, you guys. That actually did not take long at all. And like, look at that length. My hair reaches down here below my belly button. seen my hair this pin straight like it is so straight it's like a freaking needle oh my god Woo. okay so my arms don't even hurt like i'm just so shook right now guys like i'm gonna just put a picture of what my hair looked like last year when I straightened it so let me just scooch over yo look at that look at that this straightener is bomb bomb.com like it got my hair straightened fast it doesn't feel dry it's so silky so smooth i'm so impressed t3 now all i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna add some serum to the ends this is the bye bye frizz by mark anthony so i'm just gonna put a couple pumps of the serum and just run it through the ends of my hair i'm just gonna put a little bit on the flyaways at the top whatever is left in my hand oh my god now i can do an asmr video of me brushing my hair all right y'all this is the final look right here i'm seriously obsessed with it i have never seen my hair this pen straight i'm just so happy with the length of my hair like it's gotten so long it's past my belly button like come on Come on. This has been my dream to grow my hair out this long, but 
it might be time for a haircut very very soon so let me know what you guys think in the comments and let me know what hair straightener you use and you recommend me to try out so i hope you enjoyed this video and until next time my dreamers